Hello, and welcome back to another episode of the programme where we use future technologies to bring back dead philosophers to discuss methods of proving facts with people from the present day. This week's guest is Bertrand Russell, and you're watching Where's the Proof? <laughs> present day person, please begin with how you know facts are facts today. Well, truth is like personal, you don't really have facts, it's more like my truth. Your truth? You mean there is no objectivity? So like, no? Okay. So I created an analogy that there are tiny, minuscule tea cups orbiting the sun between Earth and Mars. But they are so minuscule, so insignificant to the human eye that you can't see them. Yeah, I believe that. No, but, but there's not. It's an analogy. Yeah, I go over all that conspiracy stuff. But it's not a conspiracy. It's an unfalsifiable claim. When somebody says something ridiculous, it is their job, their duty, to prove it. It is not the job of the listener to disprove it. Of course, when I was talking about this originally, it had to do with God, but it, it still works. Nah, there probably is. They probably don't want us to know about it. Okay. It looks like we've reached our natural conclusion, and as always, reason and rationale have been left at the door. Tune in next week when our guest Rene Descartes will question if maybe everyone but him is a robot, and our present day person will no doubt agree with it. But until then, you've been watching Where's the Facts. Goodbye. No, no, no. I am saying I can only prove I am not a robot, but I'm not literally saying you are a robot. No? No, I could be a robot, I believe that.